Hi everyone, today's video is going to be an update on my weekly product pan. So if you're new here, every single week I randomly draw a collection from my makeup collection, or a product from my makeup collection, use it for a week, decide how I feel about it. You know, um, it makes me sort through my makeup collection because I have a larger collection so it's good to always be using new things and um, get some use out of stuff because I definitely have some things that have been way too long without being used and this product definitely fits into that category so this is the Tarte Park Avenue Princess Bronzer I got this little sample somehow um I would assume it's probably from a Sephora order I used to really love ordering on Sephora because you get all those samples and I do still feel like that's good but I also think it makes you use things that you wouldn't uh necessarily like purchase which just kind of creates more and more um, of a desire to buy things and want more and more um, and you know create more and more waste is kind of how I'm trying to think of it now I not I mean you know I'm not gonna lie and say like oh I never want anything because I definitely still do um, but I definitely found myself making orders or things like that just because they had a good extra freebie or um, a freebie that I ne didn't necessarily wouldn't have bought but I was like well it's free so I might as well try it so um, I think that's probably how I came across this. So this is the original Tar Tarte Park Avenue Princess Bronzer. I do have it today kind of on my forehead and just kind of dusted around my face. It's a pretty warm tone bronzer. Um, and it's fine. I don't know. I like it alright. I don't think it's anything great, honestly. Uh, this little pan, you can even like kind of see those rings. So maybe I'll hit pan on it soon. That would be exciting. But I definitely don't think I would ever purchase this again. Or I don't think I purchased, you know, purchase it because um, I just don't feel like it's that exciting to me. Um, I like a matte bronzer or like a contour. I use that, you know, in the hollows of my cheek, and that's pretty much what I do. So I don't think I think you know it's important that as you have more makeup, you kind of learn what you like and what you don't, um, and then so you can make smarter and better purchases in the future. And I I won't purchase another shimmery bronzer. I don't think so. Um, that, you know, I'm, I'm keeping it, but I will be, I don't think, just throwing it out, I don't think I'm going to be decluttering items anymore uh, from this project. So I was decluttering some things. I recently did a pretty substantial declutter. I don't know. I guess it depends on how you define substantial. But I went through my collection and pulled out some things for my cousin who's starting beauty school. Um, and I might do that again at some other point, but right now I don't want to be decluttering more. Um, so for right now, I'm kind of just not decluttering things. Uh, so there you go. That might change. I go back and forth, but that's how I'm feeling right now. So anyway, um, I have 1,259 items in my collection. So let's generate 985. I'm sure it's an eyeshadow palette. Most um, of my collection, if you watched my recent inventory, you know it is um, composed of eyeshadow palettes. So it's more likely that I'm going to get an eyeshadow palette than anything else. Oh, wait. Went a little too far. 9.85. Yes? Yes. Okay, so not an eyeshadow palette. Wow. It is the Tarte Sex Kit and Liner, which is right here. So another Tarte item. I don't feel like my collection is super full of Tarte, but that's interesting. So this is just a little black liner. I actually got it. I can show you. So this is the Tarte Magic Star Palette. Um, it was a Christmas palette a while ago. Um, and in it was mascara, two lip products, and this liner. It lived right here. So that's how I got it. Um, so it is a mini. I want to say there's not that much in it. Let me. That's all that's in it. I don't feel like I can use that up in a week. It's not that much, but I only use liner in my waterline. So we'll see. I will definitely use it um, and play with that this week. And. We'll let you know how it went uh, next week. So I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, if you have any questions, requests, suggestions, or comments, go ahead and leave those down below, and I'll see you all soon. Bye.